A lot of people ask me how I became the number one real estate agent in the world. They want to know, how do I sell almost $100 million worth of homes every month? Sorry, I intermittent fast and I'm hungry. Whatever. So, I decided to create a video, the video you're watching, to show you how to become a real estate agent. I'm gonna give you the seven steps you need to take to become a million dollar broker like me. Hey, can you approve these listings? Those listings, they look great. I'm gonna show you how I went from being a broke, lonely real estate agent to being a big one with this huge team and five assistants who help me every single day. Can you sign this check? Sure, what's it for? Don't worry about it. Okay. So, step one. You need to find the best real estate agent in your neighborhood and you need to work for them for free. Yes, you need to be their intern. And you're gonna do a lot of things that you don't like, like getting coffee, shredding paper, getting their dry cleaning. But when you do this, it's gonna give you the opportunity to realize if real estate brokerage is really for you with really low risk, and if you do right by that real estate agent, they're going to hire you on their team. Hey, Ryan, you have a phone call. Thanks, intern. Hello. You want to know where to get your real estate license? I'm glad you asked. Next step is getting your real estate license. All kidding aside, getting your real estate license is really, really serious. And the way you do it depends on where you live. So go to Google or ask your mentor who you just interned for where they got their real estate license. It's easy. See, I can type it in. How to get your real estate license in Texas. Pretty simple, scroll down. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, step one, must be at least 18. Register for and complete 100 hours of required education. Either the team leader who you're interning for or the internet will tell you where and how to get your real estate license. And what's great is most times you can do it from home. You can also do it in person, which is the way I did it, or you can do it at work or at school. And what could be really cool is if you're doing it at work because you already have another job and you're getting your real estate license online, sometimes the person next to you wants to do real estate too and you can ask them maybe to join up on your team and you can get going right away. Like Bliss, right here. Dude, I'm getting my real estate license. You wanna get yours too? Nope. Okay, so now you got your license. Now what? Before you can go out onto the street and hold up your hand and say, hi, I'm a real estate agent. Would you like to buy or sell a home with me? You need to get your license sponsored by a brokerage. And better yet, you wanna join a team. You don't wanna do what I did when I first started and work by yourself and not know what to do because most real estate agents who start and work by themselves who don't know what to do end up quitting and doing something else. So that's not what you wanna do. And if you did step one, that mentor is your easiest first way in to that team. And the team's gonna have all the resources, the knowledge, the know-how to basically be your continuing education into the business after you get your license. And honestly, the best part about a team is that it's like family and everybody does everything together and they all love each other. It's super, super cool. What's up, team? So you're on a team. Now, step four. You build your sphere of influence. And you do that in two separate ways. One, you do your warm sphere. That's your mom, your dad, your foster mom, your baby daddy, everyone you knew in first grade, everyone from Facebook, from Instagram. You reach out to them and you say, hi, my name is Bill. I'm a real estate agent now. Would you like to buy or sell with me? I promise you, your first clients are gonna come from that warm sphere of influence that you're going to build. Your next sphere is your cold sphere. Those are people you meet on the street, people you meet like I did in Starbucks. Some of my first clients were pregnant women in Starbucks because they needed more room, and it's easy to do. Here, look, I'll show you how to do it right now. Hey man, my name's Ryan, I'm in real estate. Would you like to buy or sell? Okay, it takes time. Now you've got the ball rolling. You're licensed, you're on a team, you've got support, people are starting to know who you are, even on the street. What's next? Step five, set up your day for success, also known as finder, keeper, doer. If you read my book or you take my course, you'll know that I set up my entire day and I calendar it so that I can be successful and generate leads. Finder is putting on your CEO hat. Set time in your calendar every day to go out and think about how you're gonna build your new business as an entrepreneur. 
because that's really what real estate agents are. We are entrepreneurs who go out and try to find people to buy and sell homes. Next, you're gonna set a little time for keeper. Keeper time is like the CFO. Keeper time is time you're gonna focus on advertising money. How am I gonna go out there and spend money to make money? Because scared money don't make money. Maybe that's taking $10 that I have in my pocket and going to Starbucks and getting a couple lattes for people that could be clients. Maybe that's doing a mailer and putting stamps on postcards. Whatever it might be, you have something to spend to make money. And then lastly is the doer time. Doer time is the operations. That's you actually putting the stamps on that postcard. That's you actually running up and down the street, showing the apartments, painting the walls of the little studio that you just got to rent for $600 a month. Finder Keeper Doer, FKD. You structure your day for success that way and you will grow your business as a successful sales entrepreneur, I guarantee it. Okay, so your day is structured. You're starting to build up your sphere of influence. You are networking your ass off. You're using the other agents in your office. You're helping them, maybe running their open houses, and you're building. Now you feel like a true salesperson. Now what? Now it's step six. Probably my biggest action item, maybe the most effective step. That's the three Fs. Follow up, follow through, follow back. It's how I really have built my entire business by structuring my day, find your keeper doer, by working with other agents and networking my butt off and following up like it's my job because it is my job because I'm a real estate agent and that's what real estate agents do. We follow up, we follow through and we follow back. So the first F is follow up. That's making sure everybody I meet on the street, everyone I talk to, I stay on top of them until they die and their grandparents. I'm kind of joking, kind of not. That's my job, I'm gonna follow up with everybody because when they think real estate, I want them to think Ryan. Then you've got follow through. Following through is the easiest thing to do, but the one that people have the hardest time with, it's just doing what you say you're going to do. If you meet someone at an event and they say, actually, I am looking for a home. Cool, and you say, I'm gonna send you something right now, I'm gonna send it when I get home, I'm gonna send you a listing, do it! It blows my mind how many real estate agents out there say they're gonna do something and then they don't do it. And then probably the most important F is following back. Anyone that you've ever met, anyone you've ever worked with, going back to them. Hey, happy birthday. Hey, congrats on your one year closing anniversary. The house across the street from you just sold for a record price. Aren't you happy you got the deal you did? Follow up, follow through, follow back. Those are the three Fs that is step six. You do that on top of everything else, you are now well on your way to crushing it. And now a quick word from our sponsors. This video is brought to you by the good people over at Audible. Audible is one of the greatest companies in the world. Actually, when I was writing my book, I thought to myself, man, who reads books anymore? Literally. But I knew I wanted it to be on Audible. So if you go to audible.com, you can download Sell it Like Sirhan and you can listen to all of the chapters the same way you would listen to podcasts. You can listen to it on the go. It's actually really cool and I read it myself. But Audible is an amazing, amazing place. And it's not just for audiobooks. You can get news, you can get comedy. They've got original content. It's really, 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 really cool. And if you go to the link, that's right here in the link in the description, which is audible.com slash Ryan Serhant, and you use this code somewhere here on the screen, and you text it to 500-500, you'll get a 30-day free trial, and you'll get one audiobook download for free and two Audible originals. What? Crazy, crazy. You make your mind right, you make your body right, you make your heart right, and you will be a better salesperson. Go to the link now, type in the code, go get your free trial. Step seven, and I can't stress this enough, become a people finder. You are not a real estate agent. You're not real estate, you're not anything else. You are someone who goes out and finds people all day, every day. People who wanna rent, people who wanna buy, people who wanna sell, and you wanna find other real estate agents. 
Build real estate agent relationships next to you, both in your office, in other offices. Go to other people's open houses. Go to broker open houses. Go to networking events where other real estate like-minded people are and become part of the conversation. Now there's social media. You can meet new people through hashtags on Instagram. You can meet new people through DM on Twitter. You can meet people through LinkedIn through Forbes. There's so many ways that you can meet new people and you should be using all of those platforms to build your personal brand and to shout it from the rooftops through social media because that's what I use social for. Both Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. I'm continuously reminding people every single day, actively and passively, that I'm the greatest real estate agent in the history of the world and that when you think real estate, you should use me. And that's what it's for. So do that as well as meeting people on the street and talking to your mom and your mom's new boyfriend. Become that people finder and they will bring you more business. And a bonus step, step eight. I know the caption of the video said that there were the seven steps to becoming a real estate agent and that's true, but one little bonus step that I wanna give to you especially is everybody else in the professional workforce trains. They study, think about professional athletes. They make so much money. They spend 95% of their time practicing and only 5% of their time in their life playing games that we watch. Salespeople, for some reason, don't think that way. They spend 95% of their time in games, meaning they're with clients, talking to people on the phone, not practicing, not studying at all, thinking to themselves, oh, I'll just get more experience and I'll learn more and then they spend maybe 5% of their time maybe taking a course here and there. They don't focus enough. And so I'm imploring to you as my last little bonus step, I want you to focus, I want you to train, I want you to study. Being the best salesperson you can be who's gonna make the most money, whether you're doing this full-time or part-time, takes practice and it takes training and it takes learning from somebody who knows what they're doing. So I created a course just for you. You ready? This is how you do it. Turn negatives into positives. It's a really beautiful building to look at, and it's not like it's another residential building where everyone's looking into your apartment. Do you have a fireplace in your current apartment? I don't. Would you like one? Why not? There it is. I'm literally gonna walk you through how I've done everything my entire career and how I do it today, and that's what this course is about. I wanna show you exactly how I did that. It comes out tomorrow, Thursday, August 15th. I've been working on it my entire life. It's everything I've ever learned about real estate, ever. How I do everything. The course is right here. It's through my website, ryansurhan.com slash course. You can sign up now or you can go there after August 15th. It's super easy and I promise you, it is going to help you sell more, make more, and live a much better lifestyle. That's how you become a real estate agent. That's how you become a million dollar broker. RyanSurian.com slash course. Go there right now. Why are you still watching this? Go there now. Open a new tab. Plus, hit the plus sign. Do that. Go there right. Link in bio. Why are you still watching me talk? I don't understand. Time is money.